Hello everybody and welcome to Phobia 1.5. Now this is a free indie horror game that came out uh, two years ago apparently, according to the copyright in the bottom left there, 2014. But it's a game I've never played before. And apparently it's held in quite high regard. Most people that play this seem to quite like it. If you want to try this out yourselves, by the way, I'll leave a download link in the description. But uh, yeah, welcome to Phobia. I don't know too much about it, honestly, but I did see a message on a forum or a message board that said it was a little bit like Scratches, and that was all I really needed to hear to give this a go. So, let's begin. Hope you enjoy it. Uh, it all began in a rather abnormal day. I had been driving for hours, with still a couple more left to my destination. Being unfamiliar with the area, I took a wrong turn somewhere, which led me to drive for hours in a narrow road with no turning spots. Okay. Eventually running out of gas, I set on foot I, I set out on foot and started to look for shelter from the cold. The road seemed to go on forever, with no signs of life anywhere within miles. Ooh. Finally reaching the end of the road, cold and exhausted, I saw a roof of a house appearing from behind the trees. It was a mansion. It looked like the place hadn't been touched for decades. When I opened the front door, my suspicions of the place being abandoned were confirmed. Disappointed for not getting the help I was looking for, but also relieved to get shelter from the freezing wind, I stepped in. Okay. Alright, so it's nice to get a bit of backstory there, because honestly I was in the dark up until, well, then. Speaking of which, there does appear to be a lack of light here. Let's see if we can uh, sort that out. Right, this uh, this game does have a, a funky little feature, actually. I think if I press T, right, I get my thoughts up, and rather worryingly, I don't have any thoughts. I suppose what we should probably try and do is is find some help. I know it's abandoned, right, but maybe we can find a phone or something. Or, I don't know, start a fire, go for smoke signals. <laughs> Isn't that the image I just saw on the menu? It's a bit weird, okay. Is that, is that a phone? No, that's a, that's a lamp, I think. It really is dark here. Are there any light switches around? No? Hmm. I swear that my monitor has got like the brightness up to 100% and everything, you know? That door? There we go. There's a clock around here somewhere. But I honestly can't see it. Right. Ah, now we're getting somewhere. Okay. Let's just stay around the outside of the building so we can use the windows to, uh, to have a look around. Uh, is there anything over there? I don't think so. None of these books seem to interest me, apparently. Oh, okay, a couple doors. It's too dark to see anything. I better not go wandering out there without any light. Okay, so we need to find a torch or something. Oh, what was that? Was that a thought entering my brain for the first time? It was. Most of the house is too dark to explore. I need to find a way to get the power on. Okay. What about this door? Now oh, that works. Pretty much knocked myself out with it, but, uh, what's that? Oh, is that a lantern? Hey, ooh. Sinister music. This could provide some light if I had something to light it up first. Okay. Can't we take it with us? And can't we just, like, light it later on? Do I have to come back to this with, like, a lighter or matches or something? What the hell is up with this room? <laughs> Very strange. Okay, uh, we're going to have to go back on ourselves if we can't go through there. So we're looking for a lighter or matches or something uh, that can light up a lantern, I suppose. So, yeah. Is there any chance of me going outside at all? There's no point in wandering out there in the cold. I'm lucky enough having this place as a shelter, as it is. Uh, fair point, I suppose. Right, yeah. Stay around the outside of the building. Use the, uh, use the lights from the windows. Should be alright. Should be, anyway. There's another door over here. Can we run and everything? Oh, we can, okay. Jump. No. Space is crouch? What the fuck? That's the strangest control ever! That's just... that goes against all of my principles in gaming. Fair enough. Control, surprisingly, is not jump, either. They haven't just, like, reversed it. I guess there isn't a jump. Anyway, we appear to be in a kitchen. That looks a little bit too old and mouldy for me, so let's leave that alone. Can't open the cupboards either. What have we got here? A brush? Alright, no, that's... I think that might be like a, a knife on a whetstone or something like that. I don't know. Ah, uh, damn, it's so, so dark. Hopefully we can get the lights on pretty soon. Okay, there we go. Like, seriously, through this doorway, I cannot see anything but that window ahead of me. That's... 
That's disturbingly dark. What have we got here anyway? Uh, oh, this is a door. It's not a window. Ah. Oh, well, this is much better. Oh, this is great. This is a big, big place. All right. Uh, let's see then. Oh, this door is stuck. However, it seems weak, and I could probably pry it open with a tool of some kind. Okay, so we're looking for a lighter, or matches, and a, a crowbar or something, or a sledgehammer. That might be able to pry it open. Smash it to pieces. Uh, this way, I suppose? Yep, just keep following the windows. Mm-hmm. Is that a door? It is a door. Okay, let's try this one first. Again, too dark to see anything. Okay. I haven't found anything quite yet. Right. <laughs> so, going through that door is too dark, but this one, surprisingly, is not. What the hell? What's that? Oh, that's the door. <laughs> that's the doorknob. Hang on. So, walk in. Can I see anything? Hang on. What is that? Hang on. I can just about see something. It's a box of matches. Oh, brilliant. Take them with you. Brilliant. Yeah, okay. How do we get out of here? This is so, <laughs> this is so dark. Can't we, like, light one right now? Um, so, how did I get through this? I, I turn right here, because I want to go back to where I saw the lantern, right? Let's pick up some speed. There we go. Yeah, just follow the outside of the building, I think. There we go. Yeah, past the clock that I can't see. This way, and... There it is! There it is! Okay. Perfect! Still can't take it with me, though. Oh, it extends a little bit. Oh, hang on, does it go down? Jesus, this is dark, man. I'm really going to have to sort this out in editing. It shouldn't be this dark, I'm fairly sure. There is another lantern down there, though. Why can't you just bring one with you? Okay. Oh, so this is the basement. Hey, there's a similarity to scratches right there. Eerie music as you enter the basement. Fucking hell, why, though? Why? I fear one of these lanterns is going to show me something I don't want to see. Alright. Uh, I don't know... I mean, what we're dealing with here. I don't know if there's an actual threat or anything. We can run, which is usually quite a, a bad sign. What's that? Is that a keypad? Oh, yeah, it is. I wonder what it's for. I don't have the combination, though. Not yet, anyway. Okay. What's this? A power switch. Oh, brilliant! Please tell me it works. Oh, okay. <laughs> okay. Well, that's the uh, the first objective over then, I suppose. Okay. All right, brilliant. So, uh, very good, very good. Uh, let's explore the basement now. We can actually see where we're going, I suppose. Can we not light another lantern? I guess not, because the power's on, right? What do we got over here? A big steel door, I think? It seems to be locked from the other side. How is that possible? Are they scratch marks? Are they scratch marks on this side, though? That's a bit worrying. Maybe there's a reason for that music in the background. <laughs> this game, I think, it takes about an hour or so to, uh, to complete, so I don't know if this is going to be a one-video thing or the start of a series. So that's the keypad. What's it for, though? Is this is this like a an elevator or something with a wood floor? No, that doesn't make sense. That could be a doorway, actually. Maybe if I put in the code, like there's a secret door there. I don't know. Let's just keep having a look around. Texture up there's glitching out a little bit. All right. You know, even with the lights on, it's still quite dark in some areas. Why can't I just take a lantern with me? Oh well. We'll just have to make do, I suppose. I'm assuming that power switch wasn't just for the uh, for the basement. Okay, brilliant. So, oh, hang on, I've got another thought. It's starting to get cold. I should look around the house and see if I can warm up the place. Fair enough, okay. So let's see if we can get like a, a furnace or a boiler on. Ah, here we go. So uh, this is an unexplored part of the house. Ooh, stairs going up. Fair enough. Let's stay on the uh, the ground floor for now, though. Let's see. Where does this go? 
that's locked. Okay, so we need to find a key for that. Uh huh, uh huh, uh huh. Yeah, very, very big place. Very, very high ceilings and all that, too. Ooh. Anything over here on the shelves? No? I don't think so. Okay, let's just keep going. What about this door here? Where does this go? Okay. Is that a fireplace? Have we hang have we still got the matches? Can we light the fire? Hey, there you go. That'll do it. Yes, and finally another thought has entered my brain. It's getting late, and I'm tired from driving the whole day. I should look for a bed to sleep in. Well <laughs> yeah, okay. <laughs> You've barely explored the house. Eh, yeah, fair enough. What have we got here on the table anyway? Blueprints or something? No, a newspaper. From 1968. Uh, nurse gone missing from the local hospital at yesterday evening. Police is suspecting kidnapping. I'm assuming the creator of this was not English. It's like a second language kind of thing. There's a few grammatical errors that I saw right at the beginning as well. Okay. I am so lost. <laughs> I think I can probably make my way back to the stairs. I'm assuming if there's a bed, it's probably going to be up there. Oh, is this the clock I couldn't see? Yeah, this is... Right, this is the uh, the front door, isn't it? Okay. So, yeah, let's just go through this all again. I just kind of want to see this place in the light. Kind of, kind of unbelievable, really. So there's definitely nothing on the shelves. What about over here? What about that sort of kitchen area? Yeah, there's a lamp, which is, uh, is turned on. That's good. There you go. Hey, see, I didn't see you could actually turn left here. There's another shelf and a stool. Oh. Yeah. Wouldn't have known that if the lights went on. Look at this! What the fuck? <laughs> how did I miss this? Oh, I know how I missed it. It was just too damn dark. Right. And this is where I somehow found the matches. They're on a shelf. I thought they might have been on top of a table or something. What's this? Right. Christ. Okay. And we're going around and this must be the stairs up. Okay, so let's let's look for a bed so we can lie down, go to sleep. I'm pretty confident the place is abandoned. Okay. Over here? No, this door won't budge. I guess I need the sledgehammer or crowbar or whatever again. A few floorboards in this place are very, very creaky. What we got over here? Ah, we found the bathroom. Oh, what's that? Can I have a look at that? I can! It's a note. I might be getting paranoid. I even installed a word lock to the tool cabinet. I feel like I'm too careful sometimes, which might just be a good thing. Considering the, uh, considering the importance of my work, I just need to remember the password. Right, okay, the password for the, for the basement keypad, I assume? Is that what you're talking about? Hmm. All right. Importance of your work, what are you doing? And does it have anything to do with a nurse being kidnapped, by any chance? Let's go left. Oh, here we go, okay. Uh, what have we got here? Oh. Oh, hello. Who's this? Ah, is this another note? It is! Okay. Report 27 from 1967. Okay. Moving to this house was for the best for the experiment. I have done a lot of progress ever since. The place is perfectly in the middle of nowhere, out of any distractions or any curious eyes. Though it gets a little lonely out here from time to time, but the experiment is too important for such minor emotions. What are you up to, man? Hmm. Is it him? Is he the one writing the notes? Oh, look at the drawers down here. Oh, hang on, what was that? Was that the note again? Okay, it was the note again, never mind. Just like a big hitbox for it, it seems. Nothing over there. Hang on. Hey, hang on, wait, look, I've got a key! A key. Okay. So, the items at least, they seem to be quite bright. So, you know, God forbid we lose power again. Hopefully that never happens, but if it does, we can probably still see items in the dark, which is good. So, the key. I... I remember a couple doors that were locked. There's a couple that are jammed, though. Oh! Perfect! What's this? Oh! That looks like a bed to me! Right, is this where I'm gonna... Is this where I'm gonna sleep? 
Looks like it, isn't it? There is a note, though, on the desk here. Report 42 this time, 1968. The mixture seems to be too powerful for the rats. I'll have to find something bigger as a test subject. Uh, okay, the mixture still lacks a few ingredients, and I'm running out of my budget funds. I feel like I'm finally getting somewhere with the experiment. And it's too important to be dropped because of this. I'll have to think about something. Hmm. Alright. Uh, so, are we, are we done? No more thoughts? Ah, uh, right, let's just go to bed. Yeah, let's just go to bed. Simple as that. What the hell is that? It woke me up, apparently. Uh, do you have any thoughts? You have no thoughts whatsoever, what the fuck? Okay... I don't like this. Oh, I finally have a thought. What is it? What is that noise? Yeah, what is that noise? Again, a similarity to Scratches. Yeah, it's, uh, they are very similar games, it seems. Is it coming from the basement just like Scratches? <laughs> I wouldn't be surprised. Uh, God, I'm lost already, whereas... Hang on. Who closed these doors? Maybe it's just because the, the level loaded up again. This is the study area, isn't it? I think I'm probably going to be heading to the basement. Just because if there was some sort of creepy noise in a house like this, it would probably be coming from the basement. Uh, bathroom? Right. Shame I don't have a map of the place, because it is actually really, really big. That's the door that's like... Uh, it's jammed or something, right? That won't budge. Okay. Oh, there we go. Yeah, it's getting quite dark again. <laughs> Almost missed the stairs there. Whoa. That is getting louder, right? This is actually kind of creepy. Uh, so, was it? Is it this way? Right. Here we go, then. Oh god, what happened? What happened? Tell me about it, mind. The noise stopped now. It could have been anything. Like, just some animals scratching in the pipes, rats in the walls, or just noises of the old house. Whatever it was, it stopped now. I should try and get some more sleep. Really? You okay. Yeah. <laughs> Fair enough. Fair enough. We're going back upstairs to bed, apparently. Whew. Um... I don't want to leave it like that, though. Can we not just go down to the basement and have a look around? All right, I'm thinking better of it. That music isn't helping right now. Let's just let's just go back to bed. <laughs> uh, I'm not running because I'm scared. I'm running because I, uh, I didn't get enough exercise during the day. Uh, this way. God, this place is so confusing to navigate. What I wouldn't give for a flashlight or pick up one of those lanterns. Take one of the lamps with an extension cord. I don't know. So it's, it's here, right? Yeah, there we go. How can you go to sleep after that, though? Okay, so here we are again. Daylight! I like the sight of daylight right now. God knows how I got any sleep. Okay, um... Stab interest, has this changed or something? No, same stuff, same stuff. Okay, nothing over here. Gotta be on the lookout for keys and tools, really. Can't use that. Any thoughts? Nope. Nope. I'm, uh... Ah, there we go. <laughs> just a little bit too early. I've never slept as poorly as I just did. I need to find a way to get into the rest of the rooms of the house. There's bound to be fuel somewhere in here. Well, okay, yeah, that sounds like a good idea. So we need to look for tools to smash open doors or pry them open, right? So that's the study. Uh, there's nothing over here but some seating arrangement, it seems. That's the bathroom. Uh, this door, it wouldn't budge before, and it still won't. Okay, that's good, that's good. Uh-huh. Alright, over here. Let's go down here. Perhaps I can have a look in the basement now. Perhaps I won't be so chicken shit scared. I don't know. Just checking all the rooms, really, though. That's locked. So that's... That's... That's a key we're looking for, for that room there. This one, this is like the storeroom, right? Yep, there's nothing in there. That goes to... Right. Hang on. Ooh, hey, I found a key! 
It looks like there was a key hiding under the firewood. With the firewood burned off, it revealed it and jumped out of the damn thing by the looks of it. Okay. So... I think we've seen two locked doors. I don't know. I know where one is, though. We just passed it. And it's the one... here. And it's now unlocked. Okay, brilliant. We're getting somewhere, and it looks like there's another note. And another thought. We're on a roll today. A garage. This is what I was looking for. Now let there be fuel. Yeah, I'm with you, mate. I'm with you. I want to get out of here as fast as possible. I don't think I want to stay another night here. Okay, April the 2nd, 1968. I had an incident at the hospital yesterday. I was getting some supplies when I got caught in the act by a nurse. I guess it was just a matter of time. Even if it was the last instalment I needed. I can't afford to go to prison. I can't afford to waste any time. I can't afford for anyone knowing about the experiment. I couldn't risk my life's work, so I brought her here. And did you by any chance lock her in the basement where she tried to scratch her way out? Seriously creepy, actually. Okay, hang on. We got like a map or something over here. It's a map of the house. Brilliant. Can I take that with me? Hey, that's pretty good. So, yeah, such a strange layout. <laughs> There's lots of gaps. Um... So we're in the garage, aren't we? So the closet, the dining room, the kitchen. It's about wrong, but foyer, living room. The basement, of course, yes. Second floor. Ooh. Ooh. All right. What's up next? Near the stairs on the first floor? There was like some drawers or something at the end of the hallway. I've got to have a look at that. So the, uh, the library, the bedroom, yeah. Nothing for the basement? Okay. There's definitely something secretive down there. He doesn't want to, uh, to show anyone. It's probably where his work is, right? It's the garage door. We can't get that open for some reason. It's been, uh, been shut up very tight. Can you open this? Oh, hang on! The metal cabinet is locked with a puzzle of some kind. Ooh, I love puzzles. We can give it a go? We can give it a go. Okay. It's, uh, it's a password of some sort, then. Oh, I see. Okay. I read something about a password. I thought it might have been referring to the uh, the keypad in the basement, but perhaps it was referring to this. I have no idea. It's an eight-letter word, I think. Or maybe two four-letter words, or I don't know. A short sentence, possibly. What about the lockers? No. No fuel, either. I bet the fuel's in there. Where? Where did I see... The note. I think it was in the bathroom. It mentioned something about a password. Plus, I want to go back up to the first floor because I want to check out the. Uh, I want to check out the end of the hallway. Actually, this is quite good. This is actually really good. Yeah, over here. This is where the map's kind of like ripped to pieces for some reason. Why? Hey, I didn't notice that before. There's a hatch. Oh yeah, <laughs> I forgot. Space was crouch. Um. So, if there's no jumping, I can't just, like, get that down. Is there something I can use to hook it down? Although I'm not seeing that either. Secret button, maybe. Uh, I'm not really sure, to be honest. Hmm. Anyway, we're on the right floor for the bathroom, right? I think that's where I saw the note, so that's... Ah, uh, This one? <laughs> yep, yep, okay. Here we go. Yeah. I might be getting paranoid I even installed a word lock to the tool cabinet. I, uh... Oh, okay, so it's a tool cabinet? Well, I might be able to find a sledgehammer or a crowbar or something like that. Maybe not Maybe not fuel, though. Um, he's too careful sometimes, which might just be a good thing. Considering the importance of my work, I just need to remember the password. Remember the part? Is it actually password? It's, a, it's an eight-letter word, that's all I'm thinking. And I think I did see a P to start with. Let's try password. Let's just give that a go. Uh, yet this way. All the way around. <laughs> Running down the stairs at that bloody speed. That's so dangerous. Uh, so let's try it. Password. There's a P. There's an A. Hey, I think we got it. No? Really? Oh, I'm not seeing any W's or anything either. There's an O. There's an R. Is it something similar to password? Pa Panord? Panord? Uh, I have no idea, guys. I've got to be honest. 
There must be something I've missed, or... Uh, was there a name on something like one of the notes that I missed? Is it a month? A specific month? I don't know. Tell you what, guys, thank you very much for watching part one of Phobia 1.5. Hope you're really enjoying it. If you are, then leave this video a like. I'll come back with a part two as soon as I've figured out the password to this tool cabinet here. Hope to see you then. Can we run and everything? Oh, we can. Okay. Jump. No. Space is crouch? What the fuck? That's the strangest control ever. A power switch. Oh, brilliant. Please tell me it works. Oh, okay. <laughs> What the hell is that? It woke me up, apparently. Uh, do you have any thoughts? You have no thoughts whatsoever, what the fuck? Whatever it was, it stopped now. I should try and get some more sleep. Really? You okay. Yeah. <laughs> Fair enough.